Coming up next, it is Patrick Henry versus Put in Bay. You better buckle up for a crash course in cranial kung fu. Only one team can leave victorious. Who's it going to be? Only one way to find out. BGSU's brain game starts right now. And welcome to BGSU's Brain Game. It is Patrick Henry versus Put In Bay. Let's meet our teams. We're going to start with Patrick Henry. Addison, introduce yourself and your team. I'm Addison Kirkland. This is Andrew Baden and Adam Hamad. Excellent. Put In Bay, Macy, introduce yourself and your team. I'm Macy Ladd, a junior. To my left is Emil Michael, a sophomore, and to my right is El Costura, a sophomore. All right, welcome to Patrick Henry and Put in Bay. We're gonna start things off with our toss-up round. There are 15 questions in this round. They are worth 10 points apiece. No deduction for an incorrect answer. You may confer before buzzing in, not after, and you can steal a question in this round. Patrick Henry, are you ready? Put in Bay, are you ready? The toss-up round starts right now. In order for a legislative body to conduct official business, a fixed minimum percentage or number of members must be present. What one word begins with the letter Q that describes, that would be Patrick Henry, Adam. Quorum. Quorum is what we were looking for, yes. Each year, the Supreme Court convenes on this day. Patrick Henry, Adam. Uh, January 3rd. Incorrect. Put in Bay, would you like to steal? No, uh, I'll answer. No. They say no. It is the first Monday in October. Next question. These cellular organelles use peptidyl transferes when reading messenger RNAs. By what name are these small structures known that synthesize proteins? Patrick Henry, Andrew. Ribosomes. Ribosomes, yes. In the, president, excuse me, the presidential election of 2016, which Western state supported, sported the highest percentage of votes for Republicans at approximately 70%? Its capital is, that would be Patrick Henry, Adam. Texas. Incorrect. Put in bay, you can steal, but let me finish the question. Its capital is Cheyenne. That would be put in bay, Emil Michael. Wyoming. Wyoming is correct. When Ernst Rutherford and Niels Bohr advanced the study of the atom with their discoveries and theories, which model by J.J. Thompson that featured the name of a dessert became outdated? Put in bay, Macy. The pudding model? We cannot accept that. Patrick Henry, would you like to steal? Fruit pudding. You need to buzz in, please. Uh, Patrick Henry Addison. Fruit pudding. Incorrect. We needed specifically, you guys were on the right track, plum pudding. Oh, you knew that, didn't you, Macy? Yeah, there you go. All right, here we go. In this futuristic novel by Ray Bradbury, the occupation that will be Patrick Henry Adam. Fahrenheit 451. Fahrenheit 451 is indeed what we were looking for there. This type of cell division results in two daughter cells. Patrick Henry, Adam. Mitosis. Incorrect. Put in bay, would you like to steal? That would be Macy. Meiosis. Meiosis is what we needed there, meiosis. A major tributary of the Columbia River. Which Northwest waterway originates in Yellowstone National Park and flows through Wyoming and Idaho? Put in Bay, Emil Michael. Snake River. That is indeed the Snake River. What 11 letter term refers to an airline's practice of confirming more seats than are actually available in order? Put in Bay, Emil Michael. Overbooking. Overbooking. Sounds like you've experienced it yourself. Which Danish contemporary of Albert Einstein? was the first to postulate that electrons surrounding an atom's nucleus order, or excuse me, orbit 
in discrete energy levels. Time, that would be Niels Bohr, Niels Bohr. Name the Greek god of music, healing, prophecy, that would be put in bay, Macy. Apollo. That is Apollo, yes. That is all 15 questions in the toss-up round. Let's take a look at our score. We have Patrick Henry at 30, and currently in the lead is put in bay with 50 points, but you're gonna to wanna to stay tuned. Our new risk and reward round is coming up next. And welcome back to BGSU Brain Game. We have Patrick Henry at 30 points and Putin Bay at 50 points. Looks like we have some substitutions on both teams. Going to start with Patrick Henry. Can you introduce who's joined you? This is Brenton Reddick. He is a sophomore. Welcome to you and to Putin Bay. Who's joined your team? To my right now is Joseph Blumensat, a sophomore. Welcome to you both. All right. Welcome to our new risk and reward round. In this round, each team will be individually presented with the same nine questions that are worth 10 points each, no deduction for an incorrect answer. Now here's the twist. Both teams will have the option of answering a 10th risk and reward question. They can risk up to 30 points in five point increments on a question that they will receive a topic to before answering the question. But you can lose the same number of points that you risk with an incorrect answer. We will reveal, this is for our audience, we will reveal the answer to that mystery question once both teams have had a chance at it and we're back at the end of the round. Now, Putin Bay, you are at 50 points. That means Patrick Henry, you are off to isolation. All right, Putin Bay, are you ready for your first nine risk and reward questions? Yes. Here we go. Steel is a mixture of iron and carbon. Bronze is a mixture of copper and tin. What is the name for these substances formed from the mixtures of metal and other elements? That an would alloy. be Putin Bay. Macy. An alloy. It is an alloy, yes. Well known for the production of fruit and garden vegetables, this mid-Atlantic state borders New York and Pennsylvania. Identify this state, the third to join the Union. Put in bay, Emil Michael. New Jersey. That's right, is indeed New Jersey. It starts somewhere in the mountains of Turkey and flows through Iraq where it joins the Euphrates before flowing into the Persian Gulf. Name this river. Put in bay, Emil Michael. Tigris River. The Tigris River is correct. What is the common thread among the following allotropes or compounds? Methane, nitrous oxide, tropospheric ozone, and liquid coolant CFC12. Time. They're known as major greenhouse gases. Identify the California city that is home to the Griffith Observatory and La Brea Tar Pits and was the site of the 1965 Watts riots. Lo oh. Put in bay, Emil Michael. Los Angeles. Los Angeles is correct. In this painting by Grant Wood, an American farmer with a pitchfork is pictured with his sister. Give the name of this well-known work of art. Pass. They are going to pass. It is the American Gothic. In what Ohio city is the Pro Football Hall of Fame located? That would be put in bay, Emil Michael. Canton. Canton is correct. In math, 
What does P-I-M-D-A-S stand for? That will be put in bay. Macy. The order of operation. That is correct. This is your risk and reward question now. You can risk up to 30 points in five point increments, but you can lose with an incorrect answer. Our topic is chief justices. We'll pass. You're, they are going to pass, and they have that right to do so. So that means that you have 110 points at the end of your risk and reward round. And now it is time for you to go to isolation. Now let's bring back Patrick Henry. Patrick Henry, are you ready for your risk and reward round? Your risk and reward round starts right now. Steel is a mixture of iron and carbon. Bronze is a mixture of copper and tin. What is the name for these substances formed from the mixtures of metals and other elements? That would be Patrick Henry. Adam. Alloy. It is indeed an alloy. Jump in when you know the US amendment described. It forbids double jeopardy or being tried for the same offense twice and gives a person the option not to testify against him or herself in an interrogation or court of law. Patrick Henry Addison. Fifth. The Fifth Amendment is correct. Well known for the production of fruit and garden vegetables, this mid-Atlantic state borders on New York and Pennsylvania. Identify this state, it is, was the third to join the union. Patrick Henry, Brenton. New, New Jersey. New Jersey is correct. It starts somewhere in the mountains of Turkey and flows through Iraq where it joins the Euphrates before flowing into the Persian Gulf. Name this river. Patrick Henry, Brenton. The Tigris the River. The Tigris is correct. Identify the California city that is home to the Griffith Observatory and La Brea Tar Pits and was the site of the 1965 Watts Riots. Patrick Henry, Brenton. Los Angeles. Los Angeles is correct. In this painting by Grant Wood, an American farmer with a pitchfork is pictured with his sister. Give the name of this well-known work of art. Patrick Henry, Adam. American Gothic. Correct. In what Ohio City is the Pro Football Hall of Fame located? That would be Canton. Canton. In math, what does P-I-M-D-A-S stand for? Patrick Henry Adam. Parentheses, exponents, multiplication, division, add, subtract? Incorrect. Indices is what we needed with the I. Indices, indices. All right, that is all nine of your standard risk and reward questions. You now have the option to risk up to 30 points in five point increments on the topic of chief justices. Do you want to take a risk or do you want to pass? I need your decision, please. We'll risk 10 points. They are going to risk 10 points on chief justices. Following President John F. Kennedy's assassination in November 1963, this man headed the government's investigation into JFK's death, named this American jurist and politician who served as the 14th chief justice of the U.S. That is going to be time. Now we will reveal the answer to that question after we bring back Put in Bay. So stay tuned as we reveal the results of our risk and reward category. Stay tuned. And 
welcome back to BGSU's Brain Game. As we wrap up our risk and reward round, we welcome back Putin Bay and Patrick Henry. Let's first of all see where our scores stand between these two teams. Let's see where Putin Bay stands at the end of this round. They stand at 110 points. Patrick Henry is at 90 points. Now, Putin Bay chose to pass on the risk and reward question. Patrick Henry gave it a shot. The question was, name the jurist and politician who served as the 14th Chief Justice of the United States. It was Earl Warren. Patrick Henry, unfortunately, got that question wrong, meaning that you will lose 10 points. So now our score stands at Patrick Henry, 80 points. Putin Bay at 110 points. Still a very, very close competition. And coming up next is our category round where things can change very, very quickly because we have questions worth as much as 30 points. Stay tuned. And welcome back to BGSU's Brain Game. It is Patrick Henry, 80, put in bay 110. Looks like we've had some more substitutions. Patrick Henry has stayed with their same team from the last round, but some new folks with put in bay Tell us who you are. I'm Kate Burns, and I'm a senior. And then to the right of me is Hope Cooks, and she's a sophomore. All right, welcome to you both. All right, this is our category round. There are six categories to choose from with questions worth 10, 15, 20, 25, and 30 points. But teams, I'm warning you now, deductions start now. So if you go for 10, you can lose 10. You go for 30, you could lose 30 points. Now this is no longer a timed round. Our teams can select 25 out of the 30 questions. And inside those 30 questions is a new double or nothing question, meaning that our students will have a shot at that question. It'll be worth double the point value, but if they get it wrong, no harm, no foul, zero deduction on that. All right, put in bay. Patrick Henry, are you ready? Excellent. Patrick Henry, since you were at 80 points, you get to make the first selection. World capitals for 10. World capitals for 10 points. I'll name the capital. You give me the country. Riyadh. Patrick Henry, Brenton. Saudi Arabia. Correct. Patrick Henry still in control of the board. World Capitals, 15. World Capitals for 15 points. Bern. Patrick Henry, Brenton. S Switzerland. Switzerland is correct. Patrick Henry still in control of the board. World Capitals for 20. World Capitals for 20 points. Santiago. Patrick Henry, Brenton. Chile. Chile is correct. Patrick Henry has taken the lead and is in control of the board. World Capitals, 25. World Capitals now for 25 points. Monrovia. Putin Bay, Emil. Liberia. Liberia is correct. Putin Bay takes back the lead and control of the board. World Capitals for 30. World Capitals now for 30 points. Ulan Bator. Patrick Henry, Brenton. Mongolia. Mongolia is correct. Patrick Henry takes back the lead and control of the board. British history for 10. British history for 10 points. What killed 100,000 of London's 400,000 citizens in 1665? Putin Bay, Emil. A fire. Incorrect. Patrick Henry, would you like to steal? That would be Brenton. Uh, plague. Uh, more specific, please. The Black Plague. Correct. Patrick Henry, in control of the board. British history, 15. British history for 15 points. The British colonized Australia by transporting who to that continent? Patrick Henry, Addison. Criminals. Will we accept criminals? Yes, we will. Patrick Henry, still in control of the board. British history, 20. For 20? British history for 20 points. What is the name of the lower house of the British Parliament? 
Patrick Henry, Brenton. The House of Commons. Correct, Patrick Henry in control of the board. British history, 25. British history now for 25 points. Who ruled over England after winning the Battle of Hastings? Put in bay, Emil. Ah, uh, King Norman. Incorrect, Patrick Henry, would you like to steal? No. They say no. William the Conqueror is who we needed there. Patrick Henry in control. Six letter nouns with B. Six letter nouns. For 10. B for 10. Give the six letter noun beginning with the, a B that fits with the definition given. A person born between 1946 and, that will be Patrick Henry. Adam. Boomer. Boomer is correct, also known as a baby boomer. Patrick Henry in control. Six letter nouns for 20. Six letter nouns for 20. This is our double or nothing question. A crepe-like pancake filled with cheese and rolled. Unfortunately, that is time. No one able to take advantage of that. It sounds delicious. It's a blintz. Patrick Henry still in control of the board. Six letter nouns for 30. Six letter nouns for 30 points. A thick Irish accent. Brogue is what we needed there. Only 10 questions remaining in this round. Patrick Henry in control. Four letter science terms for 10. Four letter science terms for 10 points. Based on the given definition, identify each of the following terms from science that contains four letters. You will receive the first letter of each word that we are looking for. The letter is C, the central or innermost portion of earth below the mantle. Patrick Henry, Addison. Core. Core, yes, Patrick Henry, in control. Four letter science terms for 15. Four letter science for 15 points. The letter is H, added energy that causes substances to rise in temperature. That would be put in bay, hope. Heat. Heat is correct, put in bay. Back in control. Pastas for 10. Pastas for 10. I will describe a kind of pasta. You will reply with its name. Italian for little tongues. This pasta is wider than spaghetti, but not as wide as fettuccine. Put in bay, hope. Angel hair. Incorrect. Patrick Henry, would you like to steal? That would be Addison. Linguini. Linguini is what we needed there, yes. Patrick Henry in control. Four letter science terms for 20. Four letter science terms for 20 points. The letter is K, a large brown algae seaweed found in colder ocean regions. Put in bay, Emil. Kelp. Kelp is correct, put in bay. Back in control. Uh, who said it for 10? Who said it for 10 points? I will read you a quotation you will reply with the name of the person who said it. Ask not what your country can do for you. Patrick Henry, Brenton. John F. Kennedy. John F. Kennedy is correct. Patrick Henry back in control. Who said it for 15? Who said it for 15 points? Speak softly and carry a big stick. Patrick Henry, Adam. Theodore Roosevelt. Theodore Roosevelt or Teddy Roosevelt is correct. Patrick Henry in control. Who said it for 20? Who said it for 20 points? Never was so much owed by so many to so few. Patrick Henry, Addison. Churchill. Churchill, yes. This is going to be the last selection in this round. Patrick Henry, it is yours. Pastas for 15. Pastas for 15 points. This pasta is typically square or circular and stuffed with meat, cheese, that would be Patrick Henry, Addison. Ravioli. Ravioli is, co is correct. Uh, that is the end of the round. Let's take a look at our score. We have Putin Bay currently at 125 points. Patrick Henry at 290 points in the lead. But coming up next is our brainstorm round. Our final round, still anybody's game. 20 points a piece per question, negative 20 points for an incorrect answer. Stay tuned. And 
Welcome back to BGSU Brain Game. After three rounds, we have Putin Bay at 125, Patrick Henry at 290 points. Now, before we continue, looks like we have another substitution for Putin Bay. Uh, tell us who you are. This is Alice Lentz, a junior. And Macy is back as well. All right, this is our brainstorm round. It is three minutes. All questions in this round are worth 20 points. Warning, negative 20 points for an incorrect answer. There is no stealing in this round. We will move immediately to the next question. You can, of course, confer before buzzing in, but not after. At the end of three minutes, we will reveal our winner. Patrick Henry, Putin Bay, are you ready for the brainstorm round? It starts right now. In the Sierra Nevada mountain range in California, the Hyperion, the tallest tree in the world, has been recorded as reaching a height of approximately 380 feet. Identify this tree variety. Uh, put in bay, Alice. Sequoia. Sequoia is correct. What noun in the English language that begins with the letter G used to identify a person whose intelligent quotient or IQ? That would be Patrick Henry Adam. Genius. Genius is correct. Within the human mouth, which enzyme found in saliva begins the, that would be Patrick Henry Adam. Amylase. Amylase is correct. This Greek goddess of the rainbow shares her name with a flower. Put in bay, Macy. Iris. Iris is correct. Ordering from least to greatest, such as ranking your classmates in order by height, it is an example of what type of scientific ordering process? Patrick Henry Addison. Hierarchy. Incorrect, serial. It went on to win 11 Academy Awards. Named the 2003 film, which was the final installment of a film trilogy based on a work by J.R.R. Tolkien. That will be put in bay. Emil. Lord of the Rings. More specific, please. Oh, um, The Last King. We cannot accept that. The Return of the King. The Return of the King. These massive structures were found in Mesopotamia and Iran. They took the form of terraced step pyramids with flat. That would be Patrick Henry. Adam. Ziggurat. Ziggurats. Yes. Which battle of the War of 1812 was actually fought after the war had ended? Patrick Henry. Brenton. The Battle of New Orleans. Correct. In what country are the mysterious Nazca lines located? That would be Emil. Peru. Peru is correct. Got it in the last second. Let's take a look at our score. Putin Bay, 165. And our winner with 350 points is Patrick Henry. Let's give both these teams a big round of applause. Now, in the spirit of good sportsmanship, let's meet in the middle, shake hands, and we will see you at the next BGSU Brain Game.